Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am gonna show you what to do, like the basic, essential things to do before makeup in terms of skin, uh, skincare. And these are really basic. Okay, I'm not using any serum or anything extraordinary. This is very basic, at home, simple routine that you can do before makeup. And this is like the most essential. Like this is the least you can do before makeup. So yeah, you just need to do all these steps religiously before makeup. And yeah, without any further ado, let's get into the video. Alright, so the first step is always face wash, which I already did. I used the Himalaya Purifying Neem face wash. And it's okay if you don't want to face wash or you don't have like that access of like face wash and water. So what you can do is just use the micellar water or like a clean wet wipe to just clean your face because we need to start with a clean um, canvas sort of. Only then like the application of the makeup and everything, it will just be, you know, hygienic and clean. That's the whole point of the uh, first step. The second step is toning. So what I use is this Avene, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but it's the Avene Thermal Water, Thermal Spring Water, I'm sorry. So this is from UK and my sister got it for me. And since then I've been just using this and this is a really nice one. It does not like clogs, pores like um maybe sometimes ice or rose water does that i'm not gonna lie rose water i do not prefer that for toning the face because eventually it just makes your face like complexion i'm not okay this is not being racist or anything but it just decreases your complexion like with time i don't know i have noticed that in me so that is why i'm sharing it and yeah, so I just use the thermal spring water all over my face. And now what I do is just I let it dry like naturally. I do not like massage it or anything. I just let it dry like naturally. So the next step and this is really, really important is moisturizing. And for that, I'm going to be using the Pond's Light Moisturizer. And this is the lotion based, not the gel based. I just don't like gel based products in general so yeah we're just gonna take a generous amount and then spread it and massage it as well all over our face face and neck because a lot of people forget that makeup is supposed to be like here as well so that the complexion or like it should just look like even you understand so yeah and you can also like massage your face like this or yeah this is really helpful to like make your i don't know make your like cheeks and eyes a little bit lifted for some time it doesn't last obviously but yeah it does really help also in the blood circulation of the skin so next it is not a skincare step it is just a pre makeup preparation primer and this is actually very important because it just makes your skin like glidey and smooth like to an extent it reduces the pores and like little bumps it just makes a clear smooth and just straight canvas for the makeup so this is the color bar flawless finish primer and i swear by this primer like this is a really really nice one this i would say could be the dupe for smashbox photo finish like that's a big statement i know but if i'm saying that you should really really try this if you are looking something in you know the drugstore range this is really nice like just i don't know like i can't i can't make you feel through the screen right but just to touch here it is just so so smooth like silk literally silk and also um please okay so this comes in two forms which is the transparent one which i am applying right now i don't know if you can see and the other one it's just a white cream sort of and i don't know that can make your foundation look a little gray 
sometimes. I don't. I haven't tried the color bar one, but I have tried other brands, and they they tend to change the foundation color somehow. So I always prefer the transparent silicone primers. That is just the best option ever. So the last step is lip balm. This is real. This is so important. Like no one ever understands that. Okay, if you want those really nice plump and smooth lips like models do and celebrities do you need to moisturize your lips guys so yeah i've i've seen a lot of people complain about um their lips looking chappy after lipstick and they usually blame it on lipstick that it is drying sometimes the lipstick is drying i admit it but it is also when your lip like texture is just not right for the lipstick so it will obviously look bad you know like chapped so and also apply it throughout your makeup and then if you want you can wipe it off after everything and when you need to apply lipstick you will see a huge difference just try it once also i forgot to tell you but i am using the vaseline a uh, petroleum jelly so yeah, this was the skin preparation okay so there's this little technique that you can use that after doing all this you should always feel your skin a little juicy and plump while seeing yes but feeling also you just need to feel it very you just i don't know it just needs to feel like juicy like you can it will just squeeze it and juice and come out um i'm just joking but it should feel like this okay this is the real test that your skin is prepared for makeup and it is ready to go and your makeup is going to look flawless and if it feels a little dry or just not as juicy there is some problem with your quantity with products especially moisturizer moisturizer needs to be generous okay moisturizing is the key to every skin care regime or routine or whatever be it morning before makeup after makeup night time moisturizing is the key so yeah that was it i hope you guys liked this video please give it a big thumbs up and comment on what you'd wish to see from me next and hit the subscribe button down below i'll be really 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 happy if you come along with my youtube journey and we can also connect on instagram now we i am so active on instagram you're gonna see a whole another side of me there so yeah follow me on instagram as well let's connect there and i'll see you guys in the next video so till then take care bye